Ronan Clark, three out of three, great start. Ah oh, yes, great start. Uh, off to a good start against Throne and Kerry and Monaghan, like you know. But uh, the day there was conditions were not the best, like but they uh, adapted well and we came out with a victory anyway, and that's what counts. Like. James Daly was always going to be a hard act to follow, but you've started extremely well, three straight wins. Ah, okay, you can see like the, the girls look, really looked up to James and the, the way he developed them, and it's just it's just my job now to take them on a wee bit further, like and hopefully now that. They've got off. We've got off the right step here, so hopefully now we'll just push on. How tricky has that been for you to come in after James and, and to do that? I could, I've got. Uh, I think uh, I'm talking uh, Lisa Woods there, like you know, and she's adapted very well in the in the girls' game, like and uh, she's taught me a few things, like and uh, and we've got Sinead Reid there who in the back room, like you know, helped, like you know, so it's it's not too bad, like you know, it was it was okay, like but big shoes to follow. When you say learning, what sort of things have you picked up over the last two, three weeks? Okay, it's just uh, I believe that the pace of the game is very quick here in ladies football, like compared to the the men sometimes, like you know the pick up and all that there. But uh, I'm just enjoying it and I learn every day. Like I, I always tell the girls, I don't know everything, like you know. So hopefully, a bit of my experience can rub off on them, and I'm still I just tell them I'm still learning. There is a very talented core there, and a lot of new players coming in. You brought a few in as well. Oh yes, there's a lot of lot of talent there, and as you can see in the last three, as in the last three games are, you know, like the Amy and Blinds and uh, there's uh, we handy come off the bench there, you know, very very good. But uh, as you said, core players were very good, like Caroline and uh, Shane McCleary and all them there girls and Tanny there. So uh, it's just it's just hopefully they just adapt in the system of play. Like. And I suppose you're experimenting a, a little bit as well, Fanula McKenna at centre half back, for example. Oh yes, like, I just thought like you know she's a great kick passer of the ball and. I just believe that you, you know, play the way you're facing, and she's very good out there away. And like, I know that she's never played there before, but she's doing well so far anyway. Next week, now you play Mayo; they're unbeaten as well. So somebody has to lose that one. Ah, yes, but it could be a draw. Like, but <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'll just say, like, you know, Mayo is probably the benchmark at the minute. Like, you know, where the teams need to be at. Uh, but we we'll travel down to Mayo and give it a good go anyway, and see where it comes. That could be your toughest test yet. It could be, it could, but every every game's tough, like and, you know, and, and the girls are trying to adapt to life in Division One, and they've done it well so far, like you know, but just a couple of things they need to learn and pick up, and uh, hopefully we can develop in a good team.